I think I'm starting to hit a wall in terms of the clash between my motivations and the end goal of how I enjoy my training. Now, my end goal has always been to learn skills, to perform uh, feats of strength that uh, is undeniable and just completely shows a um, aesthetic of just pure, uh, again, just pure strength. That's what I truly aim for. And that's why I enjoy doing the planche, the front lever, and doing heavy squats. I feel like that is the epitome of um, ideal strength. And it's just that alluring factor that's made me enjoy training so much. Now, um, for a while, so after my uh, shoulder sprain a week ago, I've been slowly conditioning and working more on hypertrophy work, less extent of um, isometrics, which put intense load on my joints and uh, regions that I do believe I need to recover a bit more in. So that is why you can see that I'm doing a lot more weighted pull-up variations with lighter weight. Um, I'm doing more like, uh, again, just external loaded factors rather than um, more so skill-based calisthenic stuff. Now, obviously, I am going to be continuing um, skills since that is my main goal. But um, man, this training scheme, I'm really enjoying this hypertrophy work. It's been so long since I've just gone all out, just went into a working set, like a um, uh, like exercises that I always use as supplementary work, but going in there fresh. It's been so long since I've done weighted pull-ups at the start of a session and just went all out. It just feels amazing. I love the pump. Um, I enjoy how much um, how much it feels. Honestly, it feels like I'm just just like brute strengthening everything, and it just feels very um, very. Uh, I guess like I don't know. I just it, it's just something I'm really enjoying in training. So obviously, there's a conflicting factor here that this does not truly uh, help with my skill sets because there's a lack of specificity. Now, obviously, I am going to be increasing my muscles, uh, like muscle hypertrophy and raw strength. But if I am lacking the training uh, stimulus for the specificity of front lever and planche, then obviously there is no room for improvement. Um, but uh, it's been a while and I think for the past three months, I've been eating quite a bit as well. I've been on a uh, not an unintentional bulk mainly because I've just been meal prepping for convenience and I've gained about four kilos and yet my skills have improved and I've, that's when I've been seeing the most strength improvement. So it's pretty interesting to see that despite a gain in weight, I'm improving in calisthenics, which completely contradicts the um, physics of what calisthenics is supposed to be. It's an aesthetic in terms of your body weight. It's relative strength. Now, obviously, this may be an issue of, well, maybe I gain muscles, uh, muscle weight in my torso. So obviously, it would reduce the cal- uh, counter the balance that's demanded for like leverages and whatnot. But my squats have been feeling very strong as well. So obviously, there may have been some um, muscle gain in my legs as well. I'm not too sure, but I'm feeling amazing. I've got high energy. Um, these workouts feel great. I'm going in, I'm pushing hard on hypertrophy. And I feel like for the next three weeks, uh, that's during my holidays and I'm going back to my um, parents' house. There, I think um, I won't have as much equipment to work with. So I think I'm on- honestly just considering going for three whole weeks of pure hypertrophy work, just doing a lot of just weighted pull-ups, a lot of bench, um, handstand push-ups, just working on reps and intensity and taking a break from skill training. Now, I don't really understand what the benefits of this would be, but I am hoping that my physical raw strength will increase and therefore I can um, start to work in and prime that specificity and hopefully it won't affect too much of my training, uh, skill training. So yeah, that's basically it, and I'll finish it off here.